a St. Paul's Cathedral on the stroke of noon. A thousand thronged to hear a memorial service honoring the life of Tommy Handy. They come, his friends of show business, and his other friends, the ordinary people of Britain, into whose lives he brought the blessed boon of laughter. They come from all walks of life, pensioner and parliamentarian. His colleagues too, as from the National Shrine, the voice of the Bishop of London goes out to every corner of Britain, recalling his memory. We are holding our service this morning in memory of one whose achievement it was to bring week by week to millions of our people an overflowing measure of irresistible laughter. The ease with which he eliminated every sinister suggestion from the phrase, that man again, and changed a national wartime bitterness into a comic signature of his own program, reveals his capacity for transforming even our most frightening bogies into angels of light-heartedness. For his epitaph, they choose the words, teach us delight in simple things, in mirth that hath no bitter stings. For tribute, they accord him the honor of a service said only over the passing of great men. Tommy Handley joins their proud company, heroes and statesmen, soldiers and poets. Let us now praise famous men, their name liveth forevermore.